book is really unique because it really walks through every single family law issue. When somebody's going through a family law issue, whether or not it's a divorce or a separation, a custody battle, or perhaps even a prenuptial agreement, there are other things that are, other factors that are going on that, that people need to seek professional help in. Perhaps a life coach or a psychotherapist, um, maybe they need an accountant. There's a whole slew of professional resources that are available to them besides attorneys. I wrote about real estate and divorce contributed to the prenuptial and postnuptial agreements chapters in the book, and I also wrote about parenting plans. My chapter is about the role of the psychotherapist with couples who are in unsatisfying relationships. I co-authored with Carrie the section on parenting time and custody. I also worked on the section about the MAR, which is the Islamic marriage agreement, and the section on strategies for keeping your legal fees down. I work with individuals and small business owners to repair their credit so they qualify for the best rates on any kind of financing. In the book, I talk specifically about how, number one, nutrition tends to be the first thing that goes out of the window when we're going through something traumatic. Women will come to us often very confused, scattered. They don't, they can't seem to remember anything. We start there and we help them bring down the stress level to a place where they can start making some decisions. I wrote a chapter on the divorce process as far as what, whether to mediate, whether to go to court. I think the main area is you have to kind of define what it is you want out of the divorce. We're a child-centric organization that helps support parents and children so that the process is a little bit uh, less stressful than it has to be. Maybe litigation isn't for you, maybe mediation is, maybe even just the parent education courses that are offered in New York City. I wrote the chapter on forensic accounting, and I deal with business valuations and the financial aspects that somebody might be going through when they have a divorce. My contribution in the book is the chapter on divorce and relationship endings in conflict over pets. They are completely part of our lives. They're our companions and family members. So when divorce relationship ending comes, I've created a new practice and a new way to address that. I wrote the uh, chapter on life coaches. So there's a whole section on other professionals that can help. And I talked about how to get through the divorce process and beyond. I wrote a chapter on real estate issues and divorce. It makes sense to hire a good real estate professional when you're listing your home or when you're buying a new place. Well, I wrote six chapters. Five of them have to do with family law, and one of them, which I have to say is my favorite, has to do with estate planning through life transitions because it, this is a family and matrimonial book. I wrote a couple of different chapters on uh, various subjects regarding family law. One of them was uh, about social media, using social media as evidence in divorce proceedings, and then also what you should and shouldn't write on social media as you're going through different proceedings. My contribution is I wrote a chapter on differences between the Supreme Court and the Family Court and the best uh, venue to file your action. Our contribution is when you need an investigator and what type of investigation you should look towards in a matrimonial type of case. We get into relationships for individual reasons, we get out of them for individual reasons. And I think when you're talking to an expert, it's about someone listening to you. The benefit of expert advice is having somebody coach you through the process, tell you what's normal, what works, what doesn't work. In our society, there is not much support and education on this topic. There was this exercise of Googling in the dark because there's a shame factor with being divorced. You don't necessarily want to talk about it. You're not quite ready to own it publicly. You cannot problem solve divorce by relying on Google. You don't know if it's accurate. You don't know if it's up to date. Proceeding on your own is a very, very complex procedure. It turns out to be much more expensive in the end to do things yourself. So I think knowing that you're hiring someone who is an expert is going to give you that peace of mind. And that's extremely important during a very challenging time in your life. If you're going through a divorce right now, what I would say is you definitely need this book. 
And what I especially love about this book is that not only are we hearing from lawyers, but we're hearing from a great mix of non-lawyers with uh, diverse experiences and expertise to help people going through a family law issue. Every author in this book is going to give you practical tips on how to navigate your relationship ending or your divorce. It's going to give you tactical, logistical information, legal information. How to do it in the best way to minimize the impact on children. It compiles all this information into a single source. It's literally looking chapter by chapter for what you need. It's really written for the everyday person. And it's also a book that we think you can get in and out of. You can grab a chapter when you need it and you put it down for you know, a month, a week, and you come back to it because you're in a different place and you have a different need. I think it's amazing to think about a divorce or a separation being basically a transition between one chapter to the next. There is life after divorce. You can move forward. You can have a new chapter. And we can't forget about that next chapter and how to move on to become a better you.